Hey everybody, it's Yvette, and today I have a review on some of the drugstore slash Ulta dry shampoos that I've purchased. And I must say, I do have favorites, and I do have a least favorite, so I'm going to go over those so everybody can understand the differences of each one and why it works for me and why it doesn't work for me and maybe it might work for somebody else. So I wanted to start off by talking about this Trust Me. Now this is probably my least favorite, but at one time it was my favorite and this is a volumizing one. Now I feel like this one actually it gives me that volume that I'm looking for, but my hair feels pretty grungy, and that is not very sexy. <laughs> and it'll last, the cleanness will last probably like maybe an hour or two, and then I'm like, oh my gosh, I need to put my hair up in a ponytail because this is driving me crazy. And you don't want that feeling, especially when you're spending money on something, you want it to work. So. It does its job with the volumizing, but that's it. Now, the next two are, you know, my two swabs. And I want to talk about this one first. Now, this one has such a good smell. It's this tropical citrusy, just yummy smell. And no volume, though, at all. It makes my hair feel super clean and I really like that but that's about it so I tried this one and this is the keratin infusion and that one works a lot better it gives me that volume I'm looking for it it makes my hair feel super clean and it smells really good too and it gives my hair this really really nice shine and it might be that keratin or whatever in it but I really like it and for the same price I might as well you know get this one I just kind of haven't you know like a hard time finding this one um, especially when I'm looking for it I can't find it and when I'm not looking for it everyone has it so they didn't have it one day and it kind of led me to try this dove now this dove is my favorite 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 it smells so yummy and fresh and clean and it does everything that it needs to do. It gives me that really nice volume um, <laughs> when I'm, you know, at work and I'm around people. I'm not like, oh gosh, get away from me. I have three day old hair. And I just, I love smelling my hair during the day when I, sometimes I'll just even use this after I wash my hair just because I want to smell it. It's a little weird right but it smells that good so definitely something to try and that one was like four dollars worth every single penny um, and I have nothing bad to say about that one they pretty much nailed it <laughs> with me and the last one I wanted to talk about is this Batiste and I got this one at Ulta over the weekend and I tried that one today now I think well, this is the one for blonde hair, but I really feel like it it did pretty good with disguising my roots. I mean, obviously you can still see my roots, but they're not as dark as they were. But it took me a little while to figure out how to use it because you really got to shake it pretty good. And then when you spray it, you have to hold the little spritzer down, like all the way down. Otherwise, you're just spraying it, but no color's coming out. Well, I got really mad at it <laughs> this morning, and I, I pushed it down, and it sprayed, like, all over my forehead. And I was like, great. I just did my makeup, and I got, like, this gold streak, which was really cute. Thank goodness it came right off. But um, I kind of feel like uh, after I put it in, and I, you know, turn my head, you know, upside down, and, and I shake it out, and work it in I kind of feel like it falls out a little bit which um, I, I wouldn't say it bothers me too much but you kind of got to like spray it again and mm, I'm, we'll see this is just my first time using it I don't get the volume at all so I get that clean feeling 
there's no like uh, amazing scent really at all it's I don't know it's it's just eh, but it it does its job I think for the color wise but but see I have pretty dark roots so maybe if I had lighter blonde hair it would it would be like perfect now I do want to say that out of all of these the dove is my favorite and I'm just so happy that <laughs> I came across it I heard some people talk about it but I was like oh it can't be that much better than than the other ones I tried but it really is my favorite now um, the trust me it might work for somebody I mean I go three days usually you know without washing my hair I don't have really oily hair now by day three it kind of needs a little bit of like a boost but um I don't I don't have that problem maybe for somebody that washes their hair every day or every other day it might be fine but maybe it's just because of day three and it's like okay it's almost time to wash your hair like you shouldn't be you shouldn't be <laughs> using this one I mean I don't know I like it but if I had to pick I'm, I'm gonna go with the Dove the other thing is this is something I'm not gonna spend a lot of money on it's like mascara you know I wear my my lashes every single day and there's no point of me buying you know expensive mascara when I barely use it <laughs> on my lower lashes and you know just a little bit on on the top ones but there's no point of spending you know 30 40 bucks on mascara they're chewing on their chewies and I just I feel the same way about dry shampoos you know there's gonna be ones that work really good and there's gonna be ones that kind of suck but definitely I'm not gonna invest a lot of money into it unless I find one where it's just worth every single penny which I haven't came across yet but I, I don't know if I even want to find that one because I don't want to get stuck buying something like that all the time so I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope somebody found this helpful and thanks so much for watching and I will have another review up on something else probably in the next couple days or maybe sooner. But I hope you guys enjoyed and thanks for watching. Bye.